My daughter is a first grade teacher. She's a great teacher, following in the line of many great teachers in our family, including her mother, as well as my mom. And what makes her such a great teacher is her love for her children combined with her tireless effort to go the extra mile. In fact, I want to just pause and thank all of you like-hearted teachers. This past season of Advent, she introduced her class to their very own Elf on the Shelf. A stuffed elf is introduced to the children and then placed on a certain shelf in the classroom. And then every day that they enter the classroom, they find that the elf is in a new spot. I absolutely loved hearing her describe how each day the kids would settle into their seats only to immediately begin searching for the elf on the shelf. My daughter explains how looking for the elf is what we are called to do during the Advent season as we look for Jesus' return. One week, my daughter took two personal days, and the elf didn't get moved. On her third day, she realized that she hadn't moved it. So when the kids left with their PE teacher, she took a moment to move it to a new location. Sure enough, the kids returned from P.E. and immediately recognized that the elf moved while they were gone to P.E. And with childlike amazement and wonderment, her kids were filled with excitement. As my daughter shared this story with us, I was struck with the lesson for us bigger kids as we enter into this brand new year. The scriptures tell us that the Lord's blessings are new every morning, every day, every week, every month, and every year, we have a God who is on the move. He shows up in new ways and in new places in our lives. As you begin to settle into this new year, are you eagerly looking for where He will show up next? Are you amazed? Will you pause in wonderment at His presence? He's on the move to bring about 365 new blessings to you in this new year. He who was seated on the throne said, I am making everything new. And then he said, write this down for these words are trustworthy and true. Revelation 21.5. Happy and blessed new year to all of you. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, we face a new year and we face new opportunities and we have promised from you new blessings each and every day. We know that you will be with us and you will go with us through each one of these days. Would you please help us to keep our eyes open, to be looking with anticipation, with childlike wonderment and amazement and awe at the things that you do and the ways that you move, that we would be able to recognize all the blessings that you have in store for us this year. Help us to trust you as we continue to follow you as we continue to experience the change you're working in our lives, and as we continue to live out committed lives to the mission that you lead us on. We thank you for this new year and this new opportunity for another 365 days to follow and serve you. And it's in your precious and holy name that we pray. Amen.